only one reminder of sin, December 6th. All are punished according to their deeds. The sins of the righteous having been transferred uh, to Satan is made to suffer not only uh, for himself, but for all those who he would have caused to rebel against God. Uh, understand uh, that this devil will suffer the most of God's uh, punishment uh, when Christ comes. Uh, the Bible tells us in the book of Proverbs uh, chapter 11 and verse 31, it says, Behold, the righteous shall be recompensed in all the earth, much more the wicked and the sinner. Understand that the word recompense simply means uh, to be at a peace. It is comforting to know that the righteous will always be at peace, uh, not only uh, when we get to heaven, but also on uh, this uh, earth. In spite of the uh, turbulent times, uh, God's uh, people, the righteous, uh, will have that peace uh, that will pass all understanding. Uh, you might be wondering uh, today uh, how to have that peace in the midst of your uh, trials or how to have uh, that peace in the midst of your storm, how to have that peace in the midst of your setback. It is simple today, my friends. Uh, just know that God is in it with you. Uh, when you are in the midst of your trials, just know that God is right there with you. When you are in the midst of your storms, just know that God is right there with you. Why not let us trust His Word uh, today? Let us ask God for the daily reassurance of His presence with us. Now, that is the power of His Word. Why not let's ask Him today? Uh, Father, we thank You for what You have done in our lives. And we just ask you, O oh Father, for the reassurance on a daily basis that your presence is here with us. Bless us now, we ask in Jesus' name. Amen. Remember, my friends, the power of the word every day will keep the enemy at bay.